Hey everybody, this is Brian from PB Homesteading. I want to do the update for the mid-size tent. I'm doing this all on my uh, little handy cam that I used to use. I didn't want to have to run back upstairs after doing the yard footage from the outside. So I thought I'd just try, try shooting this on the old handy cam that I had. Alright, so in the upper here, we've got our gourmet lettuce. You can see it's starting to, to come in pretty well. This one here should be ready to harvest probably maybe this weekend coming up. And then we've got another, you know, seeded tray down here. The basil's not germinating as well as I would have expected it to, but uh, that's because I guess, you know, I don't have it really under any direct light. It's a pretty big gap there. I'm thinking that, you know, I'm going to probably take this tray out of here and I'll do another tray, but then I'll put one in here or I'll put some wood blocks underneath it and then I'll raise it up to where it'll be higher and closer to the light. So I want to keep the other trays that I've got germinating down there for the lettuce. I seeded two new trays this week. I got one over here that's growing and then I've got a DMR. I wanted to try some DMR lettuce and you can see the difference and this is actually kind of a cool one to, to do here. Let me pull this little plant out. I seeded these trays at the same time and you can see this one over here it looks pretty sparse. That one over there really full so I mean that just gives me an indication of I know what I'm gonna be ordering the next time I need lettuce seed. I'm going to be getting that gourmet lettuce blend because the uh, the DMR it does have a really nice taste, but I mean look at that germination rate back there. That looks pretty sad compared to this, and they're both sitting underneath the same level of light. You can see that, you know, both the lights are right there. So I mean, there's no real difference. So that's a that's a good uh, good test. I didn't even realize I was going to have that today for you guys. <laughs> And then we've got uh, a couple of, hopefully it'll grow me some more lettuce before I have to toss it trays. Because <laughs> I've got a third cut here. I thought, you know what, I'll let this guy go and see if I can get another cut off of that one. Then I got this second cut here, it's looking pretty sad. So uh, <laughs> I'm so glad we got the outside greens right now to be eaten on. Because uh, my indoor production is, you know, I, I, I didn't reseed when I was supposed to and I kept these trays around way longer than I should have before I did my reseeds. So, let that be a lesson to Brian. <laughs> don't, don't try and take the cheap way out. Get rid of that stuff when they, uh, you know, you get that second cut, toss it. <laughs> and then we got, you know, that, that gourmet lettuce blend is looking pretty good. It's got some pretty good germ. I mean, see, you can even tell. I mean, that tray, I believe that's its second week. Or a week and a half, because I did one midweek. And then I did one, you know, that, that one was our last weekend, the one on the very bottom. But, uh, but this one I did midweek, it's got a big gap I mean, between the lights. I mean, you can see, and it's got better germination than that DMR that's like closer to the light. And it's warmer down there in the bottom of the tent because it's got you know the little heater down here for supplemental heat. And uh, oh well, you know, you live and learn. I figure I've got only a couple more packs of that DMR and then I'll, uh, I'll be done with it. I may actually take that, I should take that tray outside and see if this warm weather is going to actually make that grow. Yeah, that'll be something I can put in a video next week. All right. Thanks, guys. You gave me an idea. <laughs> okay, well, this has been Brian from PMB Homesteading with the Mid-Size Tent. Talk to you guys again. Bye.